All right, hey guys, this is Terrence here, and this is a quick uh, overview of how to install a new or add a new uh, spell checker to Microsoft Office. Hopefully, you got the new one just uh, installed, Office 365. Looks great. Okay. Anyway, so if you want to understand where the folder's going, uh, I guess I can show you that in a second, actually. So let's start off with getting this medical spell checker and that's the, the one that I'm going to be showing you how to install because in medical school you have a bunch of words you don't know if you're spelling them right or not hopefully you get them right everything's underlined because it's all not normal uh, in the normal dictionary so we're going to go to this side here free medical spell checker from Microsoft Word this is based off of the uh, open spell open med spell or med open spell can can't remember which one it is. Basically, you want to go to mtherald.com free dash medical dash spell dash checker dash four dash Microsoft dash word dash custom dash dictionary. So this there's an open open source list of 50,000 words. This guy says anyway. So he but he has added words to it, and we can get it for ourselves for free and legal. So download this. Download so it's like a, a link. You can click it, and you'll get this folder that you can unzip. And in uh, Google Chrome, your downloads automatically go to your downloads folder. So in order to get to that, we go to the folder at the bottom left-hand corner here. Click on downloads, and here we have medical spell checker and you can do this without WinRAR I'm just using WinRAR because I have it um, extract files and it's going to make another folder here that has a dot dick in it or DIC maybe just to show you what this is this is a text file and I'll open it up as a text file so you can see what it is. It's a list of words and it's really long. In Microsoft Office you can have all you gotta do is create a word and separate it with a space or in this case he used um, a new line which makes it easier to read. But uh, for some reason and, and this is just shows you that having a office doc office processor out there or a word processor out there for so long you think it makes sense this is a pretty easy way to add words to your uh, spell checker for some reason the Mac office or whatever they call it now uh, <laughs> after I don't know how many different versions of it um, they insert a you use a word then you separate it each word has to be separated by an upside down question mark so if you want to use this for your Mac office or whatever you would need to put upside down question mark here and then have the, the words just continue on uh, where one word then the next word is upside you know upside down question mark and the next word upside down question mark next word luckily we're with some smarter people here at Microsoft and even the open source communities know better they use the same one but I mean in order to install it on Microsoft it needs to stay as a .dic file so again we're, this is just the file that we downloaded so I went here I unzipped it it presented me with this folder that was uh, that's was in the zip file and now we have this .dic so in order to put it in Office, we can open up Word or any other Office uh, document. We're going to go to File, Options, and this is just what it looks like in Office 365, but you'll find similar options in uh, other Offices. And uh, then we're going to go to Proofing, Custom Dictionary. And as you can see, mine's already installed, but we're going to add, or we're going to, so I think it's add. And this takes you to the folder that your Microsoft Office looks 
pinned to for custom dictionaries. And basically we're going to go ahead and take this file which we got from the in our downloads folder. We had this window still open here. If not, you can go ahead and reopen it again, which is basically just by opening up the folder button, going to your downloads, selecting this MTH med spell check. And we're going to copy this file, the med spell check .dict file, and paste it into here. This is the window that opened, or this folder that opened from. We'll basically we'll select it and then we'll click OK and it will show up here and then we click OK again and we're done. So this is the folder that opened. We put it in the folder that opened when we clicked Add Custom Dictionary. For those of you who don't, you can also just go to your users, uh, go to your C drive, users, username, app data, roaming, Microsoft, and then you proof. Um, this is the folder that it is in. You don't have to worry about that because we just clicked add and copy and paste it from our downloads folder into here. And now you can type in crazy words like ilio cock. I don't even know if I'm spelling this right. Cock sigius. And well, let's see what it says here. That's not right, but maybe it's close to that. There we go. So now you can see that it works, and we have something now that can correct our terrible spelling of medical words. So utilize this, and this will install it for every Office product that you have. Um, it'll install it in OneNote, which again, if you've watched in my other videos, I find is fantastic. Um, and so everything that you use that's Microsoft Office related will use that custom dictionary. If something doesn't end up spelling right, you can always just um, right click and, and add it to the custom dictionary there. All right, well, thank you for watching and uh, good luck to you guys.